Hello and welcome to Hypothetical Hypocrite, the channel where I'm a hypocrite, but I'm hypothetical about it. My name is Jeremy, and here I play video games and just plain try to be entertaining. As you can see, I'm going to be playing some more Hellblade Senua's Sacrifice. This has been a very unique game so far. Uh, it's a game that I did not expect to have this kind of story, which is very twisted and, and unique in its own way. Um, I am enjoying it quite a bit. It's lore of uh, Vikings type gods and things like that but a little more twisted even so it's got different backgrounds to it I think so it's hard to kind of follow along but you know we're doing our best so if you do get confused you can always go back and you know just try to rewatch stuff and figure it out and you know just move right along with me and when I'm playing it so yeah but anyway, before I get started, if you do enjoy this type of content, please remember to hit the like and subscribe buttons, leave a comment and share. Any one of those would be great, but all four would be amazing just like you are. Also, hit that notification bell so you can be notified of all my posts. If you do enjoy the content, you won't want to miss anything. And with that being said, let's get this game going. been a week, what can I say? voices. Into the mountain. Can you see it? Shall we tell her where to go? It's not far. Go on. Look. Just up there. Is it? Shall we tell her where to go? Hmm. Shall we? Does she know which way to look? Does she know her way into the mountain? Is it? Oh, is it? I will tell you of a great hero named Sigurd, son of Sigmund, no less. Born after his father's death, Sigurd is cared for by the dwarf, Rain. But Rain does not love the boy. Instead, he plans to use him for his own ends. You see, Rain's father possessed a great treasure given to him by the gods. But Rain's brother, Fafner, killed his father and took the gold all for himself. Fafner hid the treasure out on a heath and could not leave it. 
and from the evil in his heart, he turned into a dark creature, a dragon. That's pretty cool. Depending on your viewpoint, I guess. Oh, there's two different ways. Well, well, I hope I'm going the right way. Senua, it can smell your stink. What are you afraid of, Senua? How would you say Dillion if you are too much of a coward to step into the shadow? They can't stop me. Then do it. Oh, geez, that's what I'm supposed to do? Oh, all right, let's run. The beast is stalking you from the shadows. Your sword is useless here. Can't see anything. Let's go. to do. Your father wants them to go away. And he only hurts me to silence them. But he's gone now. They always come back. He says I will die if I go with them. They say that I'm already dead. No, no they won't be with them. Stop! That's why they crawl through the walls. Don't do you them. see them? <laughs> do you see their faces? Help me! Help! Get me out of here! Don't go! Where has she gone? She's disappeared again. She shouldn't be here. She escaped the darkness. Oh, look for she took her own life to escape it. In the dark. She can't remember when it started. When her mother lost her smile. Her eyes gazing past her towards a world she could not see. This is what happens if you reach for the underworld, he said. It was a lot to take in for a child. And the first time she felt the cold chill of fear. Oh, what? I don't talk much about her father. You definitely can't go that way. Sin Bell. I suppose I just didn't want to risk upsetting her. What's over here? But it doesn't matter now, does it? Here. The light was. She can sense it. Fight! 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 Fight
it's on the ground. Oh shit. Damn. Get up. Come on. Dodge him. There's a way to block. Yes, get up, get up, girl, get up. She won't make it. <laughs> Damn, knocks me down again. Quickly get up. It's not over. It's not over. It's nearly over. on the floor. Or do I have to look I have to look at it from this way. I have to get higher up. Oh well, speak of hidden in plain sight. She has it. You have it. Got it. Sweet. I'm just lighting them because I want to light them. I've already got the view that I needed. So. Just doing it because it's pretty. <laughs> well, let's go find some more. Hey, what's over this way? Oh. Drop off. Pretty good one, too. Okay. Well, hey, thanks for showing up. Oh, this is the door. Duh, what am I thinking? I'm such a dummy sometimes. Oh, still can't go through it. We 
we're just gonna stick to the left. I still want to stick to the left or go straight where it's dark. <laughs> Alright, obviously been there already. So let's go back and stick to the left like we were doing. At least see where it takes us. I'm pretty sure I know where this takes us, but... You know. Yeah, I wouldn't have been able to go that way anyway. See if things change up. We'll stick to the right this time. Well, that took me to the left. Took me to the left again. This is new. The beast has been here. Everywhere. Must be the beast. Just keep going. I'm about to lose my torch. She'll have to go under. Where is it? What are you waiting for? Come on, why are you waiting? Keep why is it go. not working? Focus. So, so, so. Look. I know that's it. It's obvious that it's it.
Do I have to light it up? There. She has it. She did it. That was exactly what I was looking for, this but place. I had to light it up. It reminds her of the isolating, suffocating darkness that she lived through as a young girl. Nope, can't hop up on the Imprisoned rocks. in her room at night. The faces like in that. the dark, coming through the walls. She once thought everyone could see them. I mean, that's what children say all the time, isn't it? That there are monsters in the dark. By the time she realized that only she could see them, her father, Zinbel, could see the monster in her. sole desire is to possess this dragon's accursed treasure, and he uses Sigurd to reclaim it. He tells Sigurd the story of Fafnir's gold, and the good-hearted hero promises to slay the dragon if Rayan would forge a strong sword for him. Sigurd remembers that his father once possessed a sword given to him by Odin. Odin broke the sword to bring about Sigmund's death, but Sigurd's mother still has the pieces. And so Rayan reforges the famous sword. Sigurd uses the sword first to avenge his father, and then he and Rayan go in search of Fafnir. Okay. Whoa. Okay. Wait. There's stairway there. At some point it could go up. This is definitely new. Oh. See, it's exactly the same thing. Wait, it goes up. Her torch is going out. No, it's not. She hasn't got much time. She escaped the darkness, and she's with the gods. But what if they lied? What if the darkness took her and trapped her here? I 
definitely say I haven't gotten tired of the It's a trap. The beast is coming. Oh shit. Run. What are you doing? Father's keeping me away from the others. Away from Tilly. I won't give up. I'm not going to rot in here. I'm going to find Dewey. Just when you think you're figuring the game out a little bit, it just throws another twist at you. What the hell? Um, what do I do now? I guess go walking up against the wall. The skull's down there, so it's not like we couldn't go down and get it, get the skull. There's gotta be a way down there. There's gotta be. Ever could ever, there's a torch magically there for every time. I'm just playing. Oh, the walls are decaying. That's lovely. Die. 
get out of there. I she got the corner. And it's not letting me focus for some reason. So Ooh, at least I finished the other dude. Bing bada boom. I was gonna say earlier when I kinda got cut off. I'm enjoying these puzzles even though they're they seem repetitive, but they're still very different each time you do it. Or each time a puzzle is presented. The sound and all the whispering voices and everything. The water sounds. Everything is just going together very well. Her father tried to help her, but she wouldn't listen. He was doing his best. She never, ever listened. All of that makes this a really good game. He was trying to save I'm her enjoying it quite a bit. Zinbel was trying to save her from the darkness. But she wouldn't listen. She is dead. And now everybody is dead. Come on. It's all her fault. All her fault. She should have known. She shouldn't have known. Why doesn't she learn? She will she learn? Oh, what? But now the darkness nasty. has Dillian's soul. The dragon Fafner is so large and deadly that it would be impossible to kill him face to face. But each day, Fafner crawls across the heath to find water. So Sigurd digs a pit in the dragon's path and lies in wait in it. When Fafner slithers overhead, Sigurd sinks his sword into the dragon up to the hilt. Sigurd leaps from the pit and Fafner sees his killer. He warns Sigurd that the treasure will lead to his death, as it led to the death of all who owned it. Sigurd replies that death comes to all men, and every man would want to be wealthy until that day. And he takes the treasure. The darkness will take her like it took her mother. Deep and deep. The beast knows. The beast knows exactly where she is. She's falling for it. She with her tricks every time. Plays into his hands. The lights run out. She'll die. 
She can't. She'll die. She has to. She can't. <laughs> Although Sigurd kills the dragon, Rian wants to keep Fafnir's gold all for himself. Rian also wants the strength and wisdom of the dragon, so he drinks its blood and asks Sigurd to roast Fafnir's heart for him. Sigurd does so, but when he touches the roasted heart to see if it is done, he burns his finger. Without thinking, he licks his finger and tastes the dragon's blood. In that moment, he understands the language of birds and hears them talk nearby. I don't know what to do here. I forgot you guys were muted then for a second before I was muted. But yeah, obviously it's all to do with that there, but we need to get that thing lit somehow. And we can't get past this without our torch going out. I know I am so close. I just don't know how to do this. I can't drop it.
went insane. That's a crazy way to die. light back there now. What's the light from? Where is she going? Faster, faster, keep going, keep going. Well, obviously I've gone backwards. Okay. Faster, faster, keep going, keep going. saw light at one point but I don't know looks like we're gonna die a few times figuring this out so hang in there with me ladies and gentlemen we always got a light this way that seemed like it was so far away and it looks all lit up from here well 
What do I want to do here? There's no point in going back. Well, let's see what's back here. Figured out. That's She's what it was. She's got light on the other side. I had to go back. <laughs> I'm such a dummy sometimes. Where is she going? Faster, faster. Stop. Stop. Oh, I can't jump off the ledge. flame in a world so black. The longer it burned, the more she convinced herself that there was nothing beyond its reach. How little separates us from what we fear. These voices are pretty cool to listen to sometimes. Sigurd's new found power lets him hear the birds speak. And they say, Sigurd should eat the heart himself. Rain eats Fafner's roasted heart and takes Fafner's treasure. And he embarks on a new quest to ride to Hinderfell and find Brynhild, the Valkyrie. Wow. These stories. Whoa, what? I guess we're going into a hole. Diving on into that hole. Whoa. Whoa, that's creepy as hell. Oh, 
I can smell your blood. No! You betray your God. I am leaving with him! You turn your back on me. <laughs> that is why Dillion will rot in hell. Yes, get up. I say it, I die. Oh, jeez. This is a good fight, though. This is crazy. I don't know how I'm gonna beat it, but I'm gonna do my best. I didn't see that. I got lucky the first time. What? Didn't even hit me. Not even close. Jesus. 
people think of evil as an unnatural, invisible force. What just happened? And so invoke the gods for protection. But evil can come from the hand behind the gods. Oh, I won. I survived it. A familiar Sweet. hand. Cold and cruel. He tried to fix her with his rituals. Kept her trapped in that hole. She couldn't say which was worse. The darkness. Or the monster that her father had become. She couldn't fight them both. And so she left. Headed for the one ray of light that shone down on her. If she had stayed, she wouldn't have survived. But maybe Delian would still be alive. I'm so sorry, my love. She will save his soul. Even if this time she can't save her own. Forgive me, Senua. I know you have no reason to trust me anymore. But believe this. It was my mission to make you hate. To hate the darkness with a passion so great it would focus your mind on this quest. But without it, I feel the all this time, I wanted to protect you from the truth that would have destroyed you a long time ago. But you have conquered your darkness at every turn. Oh my god. You deserve to see that I'm the veil of darkness. Then take me to the west and trust me as deep as we can go. I won't stand in your way. She has to trust him. You will not survive what is in there. Okay, it had me thinking there that it, those were all her different timelines going through the same time loop of what she's doing and has been doing. And maybe we're going to break out of that loop with this game? I don't know. We'll find out though. Maybe I'm overthinking it. Hella's gaze, searching for secrets inside of me. Secrets that even I can't see. I'm not here to fight my past. I'm here for Dillian. I will fulfill my vow, whatever the cost. How will she do it? There must be a way. Sorry, you have to try. Get to the gate. She'll never make it. Freaking right stick. I keep saying I'm gonna clean my controller, but I never do. She can see it. The bridge. She can't cross the bridge. It's broken. She has to fix it. It's too dangerous. She's done it before. You have to fight on. Final battle. Get his soul back. It's the final task. Yes, it is. This isn't just a broken bridge, is it? Mother, you showed me how to see further. To 
see the hidden wonders in our world and explore new paths into the unknown. To lead so that others may follow, or to warn so that they may avoid. That is our gift and our duty. I'm not going to look away in fear anymore. I thought that maybe this angle or up here or something would have been the fix, but sure not looking like it. What's up here? There we go. She can do it. Who? She can do it. She can still see the secrets of the gods. She she the How do I see so the other special. one? Not from here, I can take it. She okay. must see. She has the sight. She can see their secrets. I don't know. Come on. Get down the stairs. get up there. here maybe Where's this way where's this where I came from I get lost so easily the Northmen say the world will come to an end. They call this Ragnarok, the destiny of the gods. First, there will be a terrible winter, three years long. Then, mankind will turn on itself. Brothers will fight each other to the death, and people will forget what they owe their kindred. Times will be hard. Crimes will be great. It will be an age of axes and swords. The wind will blow through abandoned halls. Wolves will walk where children played. The world will fall into ruin. All right. I don't know, I don't remember. Let's go back and see where it brings me. I can't get up there before I get this done. I wonder where that angle is from. Okay, there's some pieces. 
is over there. How would I get over there when I can't get across the bridge? That don't make sense. It looks like the right angle though, which is weird. Get up, get up. Ah, oh, damn it. I was doing so well, too. How far is it going to set me back, I wonder? Okay, what, wait? It looks like the bridge put to is put together right there. And there's the pieces. It's got to be up there. How do I get up there? Can I get up there from this way? No, this brings me downward. Oh, no, it does bring me up. Let's see. We've had to backtrack before, so... Or wait, that's what brought us here. Isn't it? fight these dudes again, I guess. And hopefully we'll survive this time. 
definitely are making these fights harder and harder. I'm about to die. She's injured. She's injured. She won't make it. This way. Whew. How's she going to find it? These fights are fun. And it's kind of nice that the game's not all action oriented. It's hugely story driven. Did all of them. Isn't it this?
this one that opens that one over there. right now. As you can probably tell. this go together here? Am I missing something? Can I actually go through this door and I didn't know? What the hell is this? The Northmen say the gods will fight their last battle at Ragnarok. Their watchmen will blow the horn that can be heard through the whole world. And Odin will speak with the severed head of Mimir, which gives him good counsel. The land of the giants will thunder with the sound of their army on the move. The gods will assemble. The dwarves will leave their stones. The frost giants will come from the east. The Midgard serpent will turn up the waves. Eagles will scream and tear at the corpses with their yellow beaks. The ship of the dead will set sail. You're just gonna end it like that? What? Come on. Can't leave us hanging with that. No, can't go through it. pieces over there but I don't I'm not understanding here uh, it doesn't even let me go into that little crevice there like to even go up against the wall or anything. Well, I'm kind of stuck here, boys and girls. I have a feeling a bunch of you are screaming like it's right there, you gotta go this way. Unless it's really as simple as me going back through this door down here again and it takes me somewhere new but why why that's just weird or wait a minute
something I was supposed to see right away. Maybe? I don't know. No, it doesn't look like it. Unless going down the ladder, maybe. I can't look behind myself when I'm on the ladder. That's the farthest over I can go. So, nope. This way. What's this? Where? And we all know this can't be the right way. It just can't be. It takes us completely away from where we're at. Yeah, and we don't want to fall down in there again. like I'm gonna have to do a little bit of research and kind of figure out how to do it but I'll do that in the meantime so I think for now we'll just go ahead and end the video we had some pretty good battles and we moved a little bit further in the story and got to find out a little more about what's going on and hopefully you guys enjoyed it if you did you know what to do hit those buttons down below leave me a comment let me know what you think and with that being said I hope y'all have a great one.